We are saying goodbye to a CBS2 legend. Award-winning sportscaster Jeannie Morris has passed away. Morris broke so many barriers in the 1970s and 80s. Ryan Baker takes a look back at her extraordinary life. So much for the experts, as usual, they can't agree on anything. Trailblazer, pioneer, two words often used to describe the groundbreaking 24-year broadcasting career of Jeannie Morris. Is it the hardest part of your job? Oh, it's definitely the hardest part. Morris made the job look easy, although it was far from it at a time when women weren't even allowed in locker rooms, let alone the press box. They gave me a press pass. I mean, they had to give me a press pass. But it says on it, no women or children allowed in the press box. She eventually fought her way into both sacred spaces of the sports world, earning the respect of countless professional athletes, coaches, and colleagues. If you talk to any of those guys on the 85 Bears, she, she would be uh, held in high esteem for all of them. And, and uh, she had a way of, of being able to, to connect with them. Morris had no idea where sports reporting would take her back in 1967 when she started writing a weekly column for a local newspaper. Her then husband, former Chicago Bear and retired CBS2 sportscaster Johnny Morris, recommended her for the gig. He said, no, I can't write, but my wife can. So I got a column in the paper for $50 a week. <laughs> it was fun. It was called Football is a Woman's Game by Mrs. Johnny Morris. The Morrises went on to work together at WBBM-TV, with Jeannie becoming an award-winning journalist. In 1975, she was the first female to report live from a Super Bowl. Although tiny in stature, she stood tall in what once was an all-boys club, breaking barriers and smashing glass ceilings. Picture of us getting in the bus and Jeannie in the Cadillac. <laughs> Great overall person. Everybody loved her. And I already miss her. Jeannie also wrote several books, including the 1971 best-selling biography on Brian Piccolo. She is survived by her four children and seven grandchildren. Trailblazer Jeannie Morris was 85 years old.